Hi guys, we're excited to be out fishing with Duvan from Radar today. Uh, as you can see, we've got a nice big bait that we're going to be flying today. This is one kilogram. Uh, people often underestimate the size of a kilogram bait. So we're going to show you that the drone is able to handle this very easily. We're very excited to see this. Okay. So here we go. This is what a one kilo bait looks like. As you can see, it's quite a, it's quite a bait. I mean, it's a sizable thing. It's exactly one kilo on the dot. And um, the most important thing when lifting baits with the drone is quite a long um, dropper loop. So what I do is, what I've seen works best and keeps the drone quite stable, is having a loop, having a line about seven meters in length. So I use a T-line nine meter leader and about one meter from the knot, to the top knot to the braid. I've got a meter in length piece of 0.6 ohm on the filament with a small loop that's obviously where the drone is going to attach and I like to make it about a meter you can make it even longer and that's just to ensure that if the bait does swing a little bit due to a sudden movement or a jam on the reel that it doesn't swing into the props this is like one meter buffer it helps a lot and um, like I said the long drop loop of seven meters keeps the bait nice and stable and the drone obviously then very stable so let's attach it so that's where the dropper loop is then you Notice how nice and stable the drone is. We're currently at 220 meters, 250, and I think it's about fine for drop. 